Hey everybody, it's Shelby. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I thank you for clicking on my video tonight. Um, I'm sorry, this is about the fourth time I've tried filming this. The people next door keep moving their trash cans every time I start to speak. And if you've watched any of my previous videos, you know our houses are super close together. So I'm sure he can hear me talking in here and wondering what in the heck is that woman doing. But in any case, I thought for my Vlogtober entry tonight, I would share my Halloween candy station with you. Last night, if you saw, I did a Dollar Tree vlog entry on Halloween candy that I got at the Dollar Tree. So I put together a little vignette of my spooky candy station, and I thought I would share that with you all tonight. I hope everyone's doing great, and please enjoy. Thanks. Here's one of my little babies, Nessa. You're coming to say hello, sweetie. Yes, what a good girl. And not to be outdone, here's her brother, her brother, adopted brother, Bryn. Good boy. Yes, you're coming to say hello too. Hello, hello everybody. My house was built in 1920. The rooms are quite tight, so I take advantage often of height for storage and displays. So that's what I've done here in this little area in my kitchen. I purchased two CD holders, they're towers, and I painted them with some blue chalk paint and set them side by side on top of a little vintage bureau that used to belong to my grandparents. So you can see going up the wall, I like to take advantage of the height. So all the way up. So the top of that rowboat almost hits my ceilings. And thankfully I have nice high ceilings. So if you watch some of my earlier hauls, you can see my items here, my little dollar store, the Dollar Tree tray, that little cat votive, he came from Walmart last year. Sadly, I dropped him, but I glued him back together. He was too sweet to get rid of. And I have a little LED tea light in him that's on a timer, so he'll come on each night when it's dark. And there's a bunch of my Dollar Tree candy, and that's in mason jars and other various jars that I've thrifted over the past year. And this little sign here with the red truck with the pumpkins in the back, that's a chalkboard. I can change out the message. I picked that up for $1.50 last year at Lowe's right before Thanksgiving. So that's it for tonight. Until next time, be well.